Mexican and Wichol, come from the southern, southwest part region of the United States and the northern part of old Mexico before the border crossed us. And uh, I really am honored to be here. I want to say thank you to the School for International Training. And uh, it's very powerful, this concept of building bridges. Uh, we live in a very, uh, as some of, uh, some of the cultures are saying, in very interesting times. And there is a lot of polarity. And it's interesting that yesterday I put up a teepee and I travel around to schools and communities and I do emotional intelligence development work. And yesterday I went to the Hudson's uh, fourth annual book, uh, children's book fair. And I was telling the children that there's 13 te poles in the teepee representing the 13 lunar moons. And there is a part of our world and reality that is based on the 12 moon, Roman or 12 month Roman calendar. So somewhere, we're either a month early or a month late, but we'll get it right one day. And uh, so each month represents a moon and a teaching. And we are in the month of May. And it's my birthday, but it's also a very powerful month. It's uh, called the Taurian moon. And many Buddhists uh, in different parts of the world are celebrating this very powerful auspicious moon and it's the biggest moon of the year. Very powerful. And at one time, uh, many of us, wherever we come from, as I ask children when we're in the teepee, where do you come from? And some of them know and tell me, you know, I come from such a place. And originally my grandparents come from Ireland, Italy, Scotland, Japan. And uh, so it's very powerful to know where you come from because you have a very special relationship to that place. And the fact that we as human beings are able to travel, the fact that we're able to use this technology, very powerful technology, to amplify our understanding of ourselves, each other, our cultures. And there's a, a very powerful understanding about cultural literacy as human beings, understand our neighbor, understand our neighbor across the waters, understand our neighbors across the street, understand our neighbors across you know, the, the different hemispheres. And uh, I have to tell you that I was a, a product of uh, a religious tradition that left many uh, impacts upon me. And uh, later on in life, even though I was raised in a small Indian village, I moved to the south side of Chicago when I was nine. Very, po very powerful experience for me. And I've come to understand that I'm going to be turning 52 tomorrow. And I, thank you. And I understand that, you know, I take up so much space, but I share these elements that give all of us life with you. Air, water, nourishment, light. And, uh, you know, I explain this to the children as I explain the protocol and respect and honor around this drum. And I, I, I'm humbled by the fact that, you know, as a human species, we're just now coming out of our adolescence and coming into a consciousness about the other, the other person, the other culture, the other community, the other society, the other world many worlds, the other reality. And it's a good time to start thinking in those uh, ways of understanding because it's uh, really interesting at the end of this month, there's gonna be a conference here, the Slow Living Conference. And this concept of slow living, slow foods, slow development, it's really good. I think somewhere in there there's another concept they talk about, slow learners. But it's good that we're learning. 
It's good that we're understanding. It's good that we're appreciating and being, as someone said here, related, connected. And uh, I was honored to be the president of the American Indian Chamber of Commerce 15 years ago. And we contacted Vice President Al Gore at the time. And we asked them to uh, allow us to gather native elders, native spiritual people, native environmentalists from this continent and to come together and talk about climate change. And uh, they were surprised that a, that a chamber of commerce was wanting to do that because no matter how much technology we have, how much wealth we have, and how much progress we have, if we don't take care of the basic elements that give us life, we're on a crash course for a very hard collision, a very hard understanding. And so we brought together over 300 Native American elders from Canada, the US, and Mexico. And they talked for the first time with 13 NASA scientists present. And after three days of dialogue and circles, those NASA scientists confirmed and affirmed everything that was shared. And the one critical core element that's going to help us as a species is our coming together, our understanding that we are related, understanding that we are connected, and that if one is hungry, we're all hungry. If one is fed, and one is safe, and one is joyful, then everybody can be that way too. So I want to say thank you again to my brother Marcus, who allowed me the privilege and the honor to come here today. And there's a lot of ceremonies going on in all different kinds of cultures. And we're coming back to an understanding of a relationship with the earth, with the plants, with the animals, with other human beings, with the children, with the elders. And it's a very powerful time, very powerful window of time. So, so these bridges have already been built by prayers by our ancestors, by our great, 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 great grandparents long time ago. And so we are manifesting what they thought about, what they prayed about, what they saw in our fires, in their dreams, in their understanding of life. So with that, I want to say thank you. And uh, I'm going to blow a bamboo whistle. Uh, the river bamboo that comes from this continent that was given to me by uh, my brother and teacher, medicine man James Ed City Jr. It belonged to his father, who's still alive today. I want to blow it in the four directions and I'm going to sing a harmony song. So thank you very much. I appreciate the time and let us all uh, celebrate our oneness.
अन्ने लादेया अन्ने लादेया अन्ने लादेया अन्ने लादेया ने जोनिए ये यो अन्ने लादेया अन्ने लादेया ने जोनिए ये यो Thank you.